Hey putas, look at this ratty ass wig. Let's go ahead and transform it into this beautiful asymmetric blue bob. She's restored, she's revived, she's silky. She is beautiful. This is actually for my friend Shada Mars. Now she wears her wigs legit, like the F out. So I go ahead and fix up my client's hair. You know what I mean? So the first thing that I did was actually wash it with some fabric softener, some shampoo conditioner and while it's wet I'm going to be detangling it with my fingers, not a brush. <laughs> Look at me and my silly little face. Uh, I'm just re uh, detangling it with my fingers rather than a brush while it's wet. And then I'm going to go in with a brush, a paddle brush and a blow dryer. This is some old ass hair dryer but I'm just going to be drying out the hair. Um, just a messy blow really. <laughs> Who doesn't like a messy blow? Now this wig has had its time but honestly give me a ratty ass wig and I will go and fix it. Um, honestly. And what I'm doing right now is I'm going to be sectioning out the hair. I'm zooming in and as you can see there is a lot of split ends and a lot of knots in this wig. I am using some hairdressing scissors and going to cut off the frazzled ends. Um, obviously I'm not really kind of like shortening the wig, I am just as much as possible just focusing on the ends and um, the splits and everything because I mean look at it. It's um, it's not a pretty sight, to say the least. Um, so we want to eliminate that as much as we can. With doing this, it's going to get tangled less easy, and it's just gonna have a longer, longer life. Honestly, just like the same with human hair and your hair on your head. I am going to be resectioning again, as you can see, and I'm going to be starting to straighten the hair. I'm using my Mark Hill straighteners. Uh, these are my favourite straighteners that I've ever used, except for GHDs. I do like GHDs as well. I'm using this straightener anyway in a lower heat setting, probably like a 170, 190 degrees. Um, just because you don't want to burn synthetic hair, this is actually a synthetic wig I'm using. Um, running the straighteners with the Tangle Teaser teasing brush and actually running the straightener with that so that um, it creates a more straight or silky look. And after straightening the wig, I'm curving the ends so that it frames the face a little bit better. I really like bobs that have that sort of curve um, towards the face. I think it just looks so much better. And then on the fringe, I am going to create um, a flip back so that it kind of looks like you've blow dried your bob. Um, it looks super super nice. I love 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 this on human hair and you can also do it on a wig. Uh, to finish off what I am going to do is spray the wig with some sheen spray, some oil sheen spray as you can see. It just finishes off the look, makes it nice and silky and not as dry looking and pretty much, I'm not gonna lie, this is pretty much the final look. I love restoring wigs making them look brand new again for people and um, you can get loads more wear out of your wigs honestly. Cut it, style it, you know the deal. If you want more videos like this though then definitely comment down below if you like my hair videos and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!